heat wave in Ontario right now. He's hoping to be the first person from New Zealand to run solo across Canada. And so far, so good. John Nabs is passing through the GTA as he makes his cross-country journey on foot. He left from St. John's, Newfoundland back in early May, heading west ever since, inspired by Canadian icon Terry Fox. Nab says he's hoping to raise money for a pair of charities, Childhood Cancer Canada and Child Cancer Foundation in New Zealand. How's that going? How's the run going? Uh, really well. Yeah, really enjoying it so far. C can you talk a little bit about why you're doing this? Yeah, absolutely. Um, so sort of multiple reasons all came together to, to, for me to want to come and do this. Um, a big part of it is that a couple of years ago, uh, in 2020 with Dad and then 2021 with Mum, I lost both my parents to cancer um, within about a year of each other. Childhood Cancer Canada, one of the recipient charities, saying in writing, whether it's running through rain or shine, John's dedication to his mission serves as a beacon of inspiration for all those who dream big and dare to step out of their comfort zones. Meanwhile, John has been picking up some company along the way. <laughs> He's running for a very, very important cause that doesn't affect just kids in Canada, just kids in New Zealand. It is kids everywhere. I, I think he's, he's slowly restoring hope in humanity. So this is my stroller. It's a, sort of a running version of a baby stroller. Um, it contains all of my camping gear. I kind of warned you we might try this. Do you want to try the rest of our conversation while uh, jogging? Sure. Yeah, all right. Uh, can you talk a little bit about um, the support and the hospitality you've gotten from Canadians. Absolutely, it's just knocked my socks off. I mean, there was a guy that just said, go Superman, shouted at you as we went by. Do you find you get a lot of enth random enthusiasm from people? Yeah, absolutely, yeah. And I find, um, you know, I put it on to sort of help with the mission, you know, with this whole run of sort of raising, raising spirits as well as raising funds for kids with cancer. But, um, Honestly, a, a big, <laughs> a lot of the, uh, the real enthusiasm that I see, you know, the response to the costume, it comes from adults. What is it about Terry Fox that stood out to you? I think, I think Terry Fox, his story, his journey, it's the, the, the values that he represented and he, he lived for and ultimately he, he died for. It was compassionate, it was service to others. For City News, I'm David Zura.